guys, it's me, Just As Orin here, and today, if you guys don't know what day it is, or you've been living underneath a rock and you don't even check your calendar, it is a magical day where we go to people's houses all dressed up in weird costumes, and some are cute, some are not, and they basically beg for free candy, aka Halloween. Now, Halloween is my favorite 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 holiday and fall is my favorite season so i decided to do a cool emo look for halloween this year even though i'm not going trick-or-treating but um i'm going to be showing you guys what i have and i have um a black eyeshadow pen right here um two things of black lipstick um concealer i also have some over there Yes, please admire the mess on my other bed while you can. Um, black waterproof eyeliner pen, which I like. I like to use pen. Some people prefer to use pencil, but okay, go nuts. Okay, that's all I can say. <laughs> anyway, and a little bit of a little bit of a little brush just to mix some of it in. So let's get on to it, shall we? And also, while you're doing this, please use a mirror for um, to look and see on how you do because just doing it on a webcam will not work out great. So I prefer you guys to use a um, mirror, a little one. doesn't really matter. So, yeah. So right now we're going to be starting with um, concealer. I also have um, a thing in my bag if I can find it. And let me just, oh god. <laughs> oh, okay. My mom gave me some of her makeup and I don't know how in the world to do this. So let me just see what type of stuff she has. Okay, she really didn't tell me what it was. So she got some LA colors, some powder, which I really don't think I should really use. Um, what else does she have in here? Please make me proud. And I can't even open this. Just great. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Oh, what the hell? What the hell is this supposed to be? I think I broke it. <laughs> never mind then. Forget that never happened, shall we? Okay, so now we're gonna start with concealer. Um, concealer is just like to highlight get like the red marks and creases out of your face, I guess. So I got um, Color Mates Long Lasting Formula. Uh, uh, I don't know what type of shade this is. I just got it according. I just like looked. I took it out of the package and I like looked to see if it was like my skin tone. So basically, yes. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just. This is so weird. Like, just put this anywhere on your face. Like, I don't put it everywhere, but, like, like I said, this is your own personal opinion. So now we're um, done with concealer. We're going to go to the compact thing right here. Um, it's like a little powderish thing, I guess you could say it like that. And this thing is about to break. Hip hip hooray. Um, just get a little bit. And just where you put the concealer thing, just go ahead and just um, blend it into your skin. Just go like this, basically. Rub it in, whatever, do whatever you want. So, concealer is almost done. And now you're going to do a little bit of contouring. This is where this little brush thing thing comes in. Um... Please excuse the commotion downstairs because I have noisy, I have a noisy mother and a stepdad. So now where you put um the concealer and the compact thing, 
Um, go ahead and just blend it into your skin. That's called contouring, I guess. So, going to do that. I do this every single day. <laughs> I have like the freaking spooky scary skeleton song in my head. Spooky scary skeletons and shivers down the spine. <laughs> okay then. So concealer is officially done. Now we're gonna move on to eyeliner. Now to be completely honest, eyeliner is pretty much the hardest thing to do on here. Um, that and so we're gonna put the concealer stuff away now. And, um, I gotta say, doing on the eyeliner is pretty much the hardest part because you try to, you're trying to make, like, the perfect line and sometimes it just doesn't work. So this one is called, uh, Rim, the fudge, um, Rimla London Extravagant Waterproof Eye Definer. Um, basically eyeliner in that way. So, of course, this is pen. If you guys can't tell, it's... Not pencil. Oh my gosh. It's it's not pencil. I'm it's it's pen. I'm that much of a human being. So I'm going to need both my hands, so I don't know how in the world to set this up. <laughs> hey Pepare. I'm I can't prepared. Um Why the hell would I think this would work? Uh I'll try to use this <laughs> if that's the case. So um just don't go really super thick, because um, this is just an emo look, like I said before. And if, like, you don't want to go too full-on crazy. So just start with, like, a little small line-ish, I guess. And just start bringing it out. Uh... <laughs> Yep, so far that's all right. Now do the same. Now, when you're doing your eyeliner, always like stretch your eye out like this so that you could probably get like all the creases inside so that it wasn't it won't look too shabby. <sighs> mm-hmm. And try to go to the bottom as best as you can. So Also, okay, so we got both done. Um, if you do make a mistake, um, you could always use a washcloth of any sort if it's old or not. Um, go ahead and like use an old shirt um, or even a baby wipe or makeup wipes. Well, mm, any sort of that. So now we got the top. Now we're going to do the bottom, which is a little easier. You just gotta pull down your eye like this, like so, and just go right below your bottom eye lid, I guess. Okay. So we kind of got that. The, the left one done. And now to the right. I wonder what you guys are going to be being for Halloween this year. Last year I was goth. And with my costume just alone, I scared like 15 people. Like I almost got into this one fight with this one girl. Because I snuck up behind her and I scared the hell out of her. Alright, so now bottom and top are done. I could try to do a wing. I'll see if I can, so just. Mm. I mean, it's somewhat alright. <laughs> I could, like, um, what? 
I could probably do it with like liquid, but I'm really stupid and I don't wear liquid a lot. So. This actually looks better, <laughs> to be very honest. This is why I tell you guys that this is like the hardest part because um, I did the wing on this one perfectly, but this one just looks so shatty. Like, so, like, just Jesus. But like I said, if you do make a mistake, a mistake it's okay. Um, I could try to even it out the best I can. Like, try to, like, wet it or something. Try to, like, smooth out the best you can. You know what? Eyeliner's done. Okay, I don't- I don't- I- I tried, at least. Okay, don't even. So, eyeliner done, concealer done. Now we're on to eyeshadow. Okay, I decided to skip this out thing because this is too big. I this eyeshadow pencil is too big. So I decided to get um a little brush thing like this. Um it's not that bad really. Um not too big, not too small, just right. Um and I got this eyeshadow thing called Color Me Glow. It has 12 sh um shades by Profusion. It has a whole bunch. It, as you can tell, like I use blue a, a whole bunch, but because we're doing black this year, we're going to use um, the grayish a little bit, a little bit of gray, and I have a black, give me a second. I got a little palette thing that my aunt sent me right here so we're going to try to use this the best we can <laughs> so I'm going to just take a little bit of the black right here and just I mean, so far it looks alright. I'm gonna try using like one of these things. <laughs> Cause that just might work, I believe. So far, so good. Okay. When I put on a lipstick, it's going to come out really well. Yeah, just using this is a whole lot better. Uh, yeah, so... um, Don't use this thing, okay? Use like a little bit of like a thing like this. And uh, just keep So, yes, do the same thing with, uh, um, let's keep putting a whole bunch of black on the brush thing, and just keep constantly doing it. Uh. 
You could dab on it. You could um dab on it, or you could just do this. Doesn't matter, but do the same thing with your other eye, and then next thing you know, the black lipstick is gonna come into play. So give me a second. Eyeshadow is officially done. Okay, so now we're gonna put this back. Um, all this other stuff. Now it comes for the black lipstick. Now, um, these two I got at different places. Um, uh, I really don't know because I got black lipstick for, um, one time for Halloween. This came in a fairy, uh, gothic fairy, um, costume at Family Dollar because I am broke. And this one, my mom's boyfriend got me i had no idea so i'm gonna use both of these because i just really want to but you can get um simple um black lipstick at hot topic for uh, like i say three dollars which ain't that bad so go ahead and just apply the black lipstick to your freaking lips because why not So far, it's it's gonna be a little light, but um, you can always blend this in a little bit. I might try using this one. Mm-hmm. I should stop. All right. Now you can see it's starting to come. Yeah, this one's a lot more better because it's actually a lot more darker than this thing. So, um, So yeah, black lipstick is good. Um, so yes, let me just brush my hair real quick so it can look. Cause I want to see if I can add some. I have some hair chalk, so let me just see if I can do that real quick. Oh my lord! <laughs> do you see what this happens? This does stain. Hope you guys know that right now. Um, you can use this. You can use water to get this off. Now I should probably turn on this copyrighted music. I should really turn it off though. Holy crap, nuggets! I killed the hair. I killed a smurf in my hair. And I wiped its blood all over my hair. This looks sick as ever. <laughs> so, if you guys don't realize, um, hair chalk like this will pl actually will pull your hair out. <laughs> apparently. And it will stain your fingers, so make sure you wash your hands really good if you want to, um, don't want to look like you commit a, a smurf crime with your hands. And also, if you do use hair chalk and you want to get it out of your hair, um, use regular shampoo and conditioner and it will wash right out. Believe me. So the look is now complete. So I'm gonna go <laughs> send a whole bunch of pictures to my friends saying, oh my gosh, I have blue hair. This is... This is actually pretty freaking sweet. So, I will see you guys later. If you guys like this look and my first makeup tutorial, which probably is the last one I'll ever do on this channel, give this video a like. Tell me what you guys think yeah. about the... I'm busy! <laughs> um... You don't gotta go blue shit on your hair.
all over? No, I don't. I need to move out as soon as I can. Like I was saying before, if you guys like this look, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below. Um, what do you guys want me to probably do a um, Valentine's Day or Christmas looking theme uh, makeup tutorial? Go ahead and tell me down below. And of course, subscribe if you guys want hair chalk, blue hair, like you want to kill a smurf. Because that's awesome. So, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. It was nice talking to you guys. Peace with Captain Crunch to all y'all my nation. Happy Halloween and be safe. Bye! Go!